I'm Grant Vermeer. I'm from Mountain View, California, which is in the San Francisco Bay Area. I'm a basketball player here at the Naval Academy, and I'm majoring in cyber operations. So I'm a junior at the Academy. The seniors are the first class ever of cyber operations majors. Cyber operations technically is just an overall study of cyberspace. Anything from computer programming, computer architecture, microprocessors, and anything even not in a technical realm. So anything with law, ethics, policy, regarding to cyberspace or the internet, that's kind of what's encapsulated in cyber operations. Studying this and becoming proficient in kind of cyberspace and cyber warfare is really important and provides a huge advantage in the battlefield and in the private sector as well. I like to talk about the hacking of targets or the hacking of Sony or the release of a lot of information of just about every employee in the Department of Defense. What I'm doing is to try to prevent things like that, trying to prevent leaks of information about important people or trying to protect your credit card or trying to protect different things like that. Because the internet really is still so new and so vast and people don't know a lot about it, I kind of take pride in trying to be knowledgeable in that to try and help protect people who don't necessarily understand that what could happen on the internet. Let me just say, I, I've loved all my classes. I've actually truly enjoyed every one of them. I think one of the, the coolest projects we've done so far is we actually coded the MD5 hashing algorithm. To a lot of people, you don't really know what that is, but it helps protect your passwords and do security, stuff like that. The Naval Academy is actually building a cyber center now that's going, it's currently in its development stage in thought planning. They haven't actually broke ground yet. However, they're building a cyber center to help teach and facilitate the learning of, of cyber studies. And I think that just speaks to the, the gravity of how important this cyber domain and subject matter is. To know that I'm part of a major that people are willing to spend $120 million just to build a building to help teach this material is extremely exciting. In terms of managing cyber and basketball, it's a lot of time and it's a lot of work. But at the end of the day, it's a challenge and I love both things. I love basketball and I love my major. Having that atmosphere where every day you know you have family, you know you have people who back you up, you have people who are going through what you go through, it's just an unbelievable experience. And basketball too, it's just been such a great leadership experience for me as well. And I couldn't be more grateful to kind of had the ups and downs I've had in my time here part of the basketball team. It's taught me a lot about myself. Because of my major and how difficult it was, I felt like it kind of impacted me on the basketball floor. And I actually, I went, my sophomore year, I had an amazing opportunity to start against Michigan State. And I got a line up against Denzel Valentine, who's a wooden award watch player. I used to play against such big time talent and play at Notre Dame against Jerry and Grant, who's now in the NBA. To have those opportunities, it was so amazing. How it turned around to the point where now, I mean, very blatantly, I'm a, I'm a bench warmer. And it, it is unfortunate, but it has taught me so much about myself and completely transformed who I am. You kind of seek support, and that's when I really got to know now Second Lieutenant Kevin Alter. He was my ultimate role model. He never got much playing time, and yet he always came to practice, and he was always loud. He was always energetic, always passionate. And I asked him, like, how do you do it when things aren't going away? And he told me, no matter what happens in your life, you can always control your attitude. Attitude, you can always control your effort. I've let that sink in. I just want to do anything I can do to help the team win. So if that means bringing energy and that means bringing a positive attitude to get the guys going, then that's what I have to do. That's just kind of one of the things I pride myself on is having the self-discipline every day to come to the gym and be positive and bring energy because that's going to help our team win. The Naval Academy, is, it's a leadership laboratory. No matter what field you go into, you're going to be leading people. This place puts such a pressure on you that it kind of it turns you into your best self. To have this opportunity to have learned and continue to learn here through basketball, through the academy, through school and different things like that have really made this an experience and unforgettable one.